is Snaztastic Human Beings. My name is Musky, and uh, welcome to a voiceover. Wow, um, I I haven't done a voiceover over a speed paint in like a really long time, because for me speed paints are just kind of like okay, I'm drawing, might as well record it, and you know while I'm at it, just like speed it up, put some music, upload it, like you know, but. Uh, you know, I don't even know what I'm saying. Um, I don't know how many of you guys are like actually active on my channel because I mean, like, my view to subs ratio is like really imbalanced, which is only fair. Um, but for those of you that are active, hi, uh, nice to see you. Um, I don't know if you guys prefer listening to music or me talking. I mean, me talking is probably going to have music in it anyways, but like, you know. Um, so this here is a speed paint um, of Uraraka, Ochaku Uraraka from My Hero Academia. Um, I started watching MHA like at the end of 2019, beginning of 2020. Um, I'd like stayed away from it for a really long time just because I had heard things about the fandom and then like that kind of pushed me away and then one day I like got a video about it in my recommended so I watched it and it was like talking about the plot and I thought it was interesting so I was like yeah you know why not and I watched it and then I uh I binged it and I was like wow okay I like this so here we are now um I've drawn Kaminari, Jiro, Robbie and now Uraraka. So there's that. Um, <laughs> I don't think I've ever drawn this much fan art for something, but I don't know. I just really like their designs and yeah, they're they're fun. I their costumes, some of their costumes are really like annoying for me to draw. Like Uraraka and Robbie's costumes, since they're more like skin tight costumes with other stuff added to them. I'm just really bad with like a skin tight costume that's not simple because then you have like details and they don't really know how to line them properly so they just look really weird. But like Kaminari and Jiro's costumes were really easy because it was just like a shirt and a jacket and I love them. But yeah. Um, so uh, I'm kind of upset at what I did with the hands because for this drawing, like while I was sketching it out, I was like not really, I didn't have very much hope in it. But I always try to finish a drawing regardless, just because it's good to have, like, something to look back on. Especially, like, um, redrawability. Like, I love looking back at my old art and redrawing it, so I want to be able to keep doing that in the future. So I, like, push myself to keep doing it. Um, and I didn't really bother looking at a reference for this, which I really should have, because references can help a lot. Um, so I'm really upset about the hands because now I actually like really like this drawing. It's just the hands don't make sense. Like one of her hands is so like, it sticks up too much. It's not like possible. I don't know <laughs> how she's doing that, but that yeah, I just kind of pretend it's not there. Cause right now, um, this drawing is my icon on Discord, but like, it's just her face. So you don't have to worry about her hands. But yeah, I, I do kind of like the pose she's got. I mean, it's a little like not anatomically correct, but you know, whatever. I, I like the idea I was going for. I like the coloring. There's some, I, I like this. I wasn't expecting it to turn good, turn out good, but I, I like it. And I'm glad I like it. Um, I haven't drawn in a while after like, I don't know, a solid week of producing art. I like stopped and then I just decided to get motivation. Uh, I don't know, like, my art motivation's all over the place, so, yeah. What else to talk about? Oh, yeah, okay, so, um, a lot of you guys are here for my Minecraft roleplay, which some of you have most likely forgotten about, because that has been in the works for years. I, I lost track, but, uh, I'm proud to say that our first episode of my Minecraft roleplay is um scripted so that's cool and we're outlining episode two and stuff we still need to um work on some of the sets because the only like map we're actually building from scratch isn't even going to be a map we're going to use like anytime soon like we're going to use it but it's going to take a while until we actually like get to use it which is kind of sad because it's a pretty good map so far 
but for um the first like season um we were gonna try to build everything out but as of right now we've kind of just decided to use like pre-existing maps like lapis point for a neighborhood and like probably chroma high school for the school just because like i don't know if we do build a whole neighborhood we probably could but it would would take a lot of time because we have to also flesh it out and make it like look lively um and yeah so it doesn't just look like i put a bunch of houses and then it's just flat everywhere else so we're mo like right now we've got lapis point that's just edited around a little bit um i am kind of nervous though about using the pre-existing maps because that means people might be like, oh my god, um, that was used by insert popular YouTuber. Most likely Af now because, you know, she's like really popular with her old boys. Um, especially because like with the Lapis Point map, we're like in her neighborhood just because that neighborhood's like just really pretty. And I, I tried to like find another place, but then like I just really liked that place. So we ended up just staying there, but edited. So probably gonna get comments about that but i don't mind too much um so yeah <laughs> that's i'm just a little nervous but it should be fine the high school i don't know too many people that use chroma high like i know people have but i can't like name anyone but it's also a really good map that i might use so yeah that's the real play status um we still do need to get voice actors which i'm trying to work on the casting call and stuff um, so, you know, I, we're hoping that sometime in 2020, we will get our first episode out because by the looks of it, we might be able to, it, it is already April though, which is kind of whack. Like we're already four months into 2020 that, that went fast. And, and before I know it, it's going to be like September again, because you know, quarantine, we, we not, we're not going to go to school anymore. Like I'm out for the rest of the year. So... Uh, I feel like it's just gonna it's just gonna fly by. I mean, I'm like, I'm still doing work, but like not as much work. But yeah, this this quarantine's gonna fly on by. So I'm really <laughs> I'm hoping that I don't like get just too demotivated throughout the year. But but from the looks of it, it seems like we'll be able to get out at least one episode by this year. I I also just want to make sure that I don't have a super inconsistent schedule. Like I want to have some episodes planned out so that while one episode is already out we already have something to record rather than like script an episode after one's come out because then it's just going to take a while to like release and i don't want to do that so yeah um i don't really know what else to talk about um i'm sorry for like kind of having a really wacky upload schedule i know that's not like the best from a business youtube channel perspective but as of right now i don't care too much probably if i if i get more popular i might have to start caring but as of right now i just kind of post what i feel like um i really i do want to be able to like just play random stuff and have it make sense like not be too random but i'm really bad with commentary especially relating to the game like i've been playing a lot of slime rancher recently but I don't know how I'd be able to commentate all of that because I'm silent most of the game. Like, I'll play with my friends. Well, not, like, with my friends because it's not multiplayer. But I'll be in a call and I'll be, like, talking about it. But there's not always much to talk about. So I'm working on my commentary skills. Hopefully I can get some stuff out, you know. But, yeah, I don't think I have anything else to say. This, <laughs> oh, my God, have I been rambling for, like, ten minutes now? Wow, okay. <laughs> I really didn't think I would. That's kind of crazy. Um, I was going to say enjoy the speed paint, but I've talked the entirety of this speed paint. So um, I hope you enjoyed the speed paint. Uh, let me know if you like me talking over the speed paints or if you prefer just music. Do you want maybe like half talking, half music? Just let me know. I appreciate comments. Uh, I really like getting comments, even if I don't reply they they just really make my day uh, so you know just leave a comment um yeah i've literally beaten the speed paint now i've talked faster than the speed paint uh okay i, I gotta go guys goodbye have a good one